I'm Terry Gernsheimer. I've been taking care of ITP patients now for more than 20 years. ITP is defined as acute or chronic depending on how long you've actually had the disorder. We have developed standard definitions for this and call acute ITP, ITP that has been present that we are aware of sometime under three months. We also have something that we call persistent ITP, which generally is a period of three to 12 months when someone was diagnosed within the last year. And then chronic ITP is considered ITP that has been present for more than a year. The reason why we make these distinctions is it tells us something about the chance that someone is going to go into a remission. Acute ITP being most likely to remit at some point, and during the first year, we're most likely to see a remission, whereas once it's determined to be chronic ITP, we know that this may be a long-term disorder. Our understanding of how platelet counts are maintained in a person with ITP has really changed in the last 20 years. Initially, it was thought that production of platelets was at a very high rate in order to try and keep up with the platelet destruction that's occurring in the bloodstream. What we've learned more recently is that patients who have ITP may have bone marrows that are not quite as active as we thought, and they may not be making platelets at as high a rate as we thought. We have recently developed new drugs and tested these drugs that now address ITP from the production side. And there is a hormone called thrombopoietin, or TIPO, which tells the bone marrow to make more platelets. And drugs have been developed that work just like this hormone to increase platelet production and therefore increase the platelet count. The first challenge is in the physician and patient developing a relationship so they can honestly talk about what the goals are. I think the other challenge is in a patient understanding that this may be a lifelong challenge and that we may be longtime friends as we move through the different phases of their life together. 